Greetings folks, here we have a yet another cool little charger from Toolkit RC. This is the M6D AC, so that's uh, uh, digital or uh, AC and dual channel, which means you can charge two batteries at the same time and uh, a USB device as well. And we can see uh, DC, it provides 700 watts, AC 200 watts, USB, uh, USB-C 65 watts. And we have a 3.5 IPS LCD screen. AC voltage 100 to 240 volts, uh, 2.5 amps. And DC voltage 7 to 28 volts, maximum 30 amps. Can charge all the different sorts of uh, batteries, lipos, lead, nickel metal hydride. Charge, discharge, storage, all of that sort of stuff. Let's have a quick look. Now, Radio Master and Toolkit RC are getting very sneaky with their marketing. Look what they've done. They've printed up stickers for uh, a lot of the reviewers with their name and uh, icon and stuff like that. That's, uh, <laughs> well, it's, it's kind of fun anyway. So here's the unit. Two XT60 inputs, outputs, two XT60 outputs and 6S balance ports. Uh, this little plug here is for a uh, optional temperature sensor and we have AC input on that side and the DC input on this side and the USB-C output. Cooling fan there, lots of venting. It's a neat little unit, it'll be very useful I think. We have a, a push button and a uh, roll wheel selector as well. We also get a little quick start guide. There's a much better manual on the Toolkit RC website, of course. So go there and download that one. USB-C cable and the power cable. All right, I have a 4S going in. And here's the screen. It's a nice clear screen, very readable. So we push the channel button, we can switch between channels. It gets highlighted around the outside there to set up each channel differently. Let's just plug in a LiPo and see what happens. This is a 3S, so you can see it's already, it's detected each, uh, the three cells and showing the, the voltage push the scroll wheel we can start charging so let's just go straight to that so that's charging now in the setup menu everything is configurable for configurable input voltage power this is the USB information current there and whether the fans on or not and if we do the scroll wheel we can uh, get a measurement of the internal resistance now, these batteries are pretty old in DC mode you can combine both channels uh, to give you the full 700 watt charging for up to 30 amps I think it is or 25 amps of charge current. I'd never do that, I usually only charge on uh, one amp, just nice and slow and gentle. Uh, my batteries seem to last for a long time so probably not a bad idea. But you may need to charge a lot quicker than that out in the field. So if you want to stop that and go into some settings, push and hold the center button again. stop. Now we can go into some setup. So push and hold the center, center the scroll wheel and we can work out some input settings. Uh, I'm not going to go through this in detail, it's, uh, it's all in the manual and uh, you can work it out yourself. Security settings, maximum temperatures, safe times and things like that. Synchronous mode is where you uh, combine both channels to charge using DC in to uh, for a quick charge battery selection uh, lots of stuff here that you know, I'd have to read the manual to work out but I'm not going to do that I'm just going to show you that this wonderful charger is available so you can change all the display settings as well there's the the backlight level buzzer volume language <coughs> light or dark back to default 
when you're in standby mode with the push of the scroll wheel you can set up the um, battery charging parameters so choose the battery type all the usual choices auto cells or uh, tell it exactly which cell if it can't work it out different charge modes discharge charge and storage in voltage charge current all that sort of stuff and start so another excellent little choice for chargers lots of options around this one has the dual channel two batteries at the same time plus a usb either uh, ac or or dc great choices everything can be configured uh, really nice little piece of kit the m6dac from toolkit rc thanks for watching